Yahoo News, together now with ABC News. It's time to see the whole picture. Hi, everyone on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, whatever else you're using tonight. I'm Mohamed Lila. And I'm Marcy Gonzalez with the top stories on this Thursday, January 9th. New Jersey's governor is on the defensive this morning over a political payback scandal involving top aides. Chris Christie says he didn't know about a September plan to close lanes on the nation's busiest bridge linking New Jersey to New York City. That closure backed up traffic in Fort Lee for hours. Newly released emails and text messages suggest it was meant to punish Fort Lee's Democratic mayor for not endorsing Christie. Christie, a Republican, is promising those responsible will be held accountable. Dennis Rodman is now apologizing for comments he made implying that American missionary Kenneth Bay was to blame for his own arrest in North Korea. Rodman says he was, quote, stressed and had been drinking. You don't say. Rodman is in the middle of his third visit to North Korea. And the Hubble Space Telescope has managed to outdo the Starship Enterprise, boldly going where no man has gone before. And these are the pictures to prove it. Hubble capturing images of never-before-seen galaxies from 13 billion years ago. NASA describes the galaxies as cosmic dawn, tiny, bright blue, and bursting, with activity thought to be responsible for most of the stars that we see today. And from Nashville, a dramatic rescue to show you. It happened on a frozen pond, and that's where this goose was stuck to the ice. It couldn't get free, so a rescuer in a kayak edged himself out there. And you can see when he got close, he broke the ice with a hammer, and that was enough to get the bird free. But ice on its wings kept it grounded, so the rescuer, you can see, put it on the kayak and brought it to shore. Once they got there, it was wrapped up in a blanket and warmed up. And our overnight bookers are now trying to book that goose for an exclusive interview with us on World News Now as soon as we can get it. You get more news anytime at abcnews.com. I am Mohamed Lila. And I'm Marcy Gonzalez. Thanks for watching. This is World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it. Temperatures plunge across the nation and the number of house fires rises. Did you know more homes burn down in the winter than any other time? So what are the three simple things you need to do today to make sure your family's safe? Real answers tonight on World News with Diane Sawyer on ABC.